So welcome back everyone, Triple M here. Today we're talking about a brand new feature that's been added to IP Vanish that I believe is a game changer. This is called Threat Protection. Threat Protection is gonna block ads, it's gonna stop tracking, and it's also gonna block malicious sites from accessing your device. So in this video, we're gonna get into some of the details of how this works, how to turn this on, and what you need to do to get this up and running. So if you're new to the channel, subscribe, smash the notification bell, let's go. So if you guys have been a long time subscriber, you know that IP Vanish, I've been using them since day one, since the Cody days, <laughs> since the wild, wild west of the influx of Android apps. So this is a VPN service that I, I've been using for a while. So definitely one of the, the, the best out there for streaming. This is going to have over 75 locations, 40,000 plus IP addresses, over 2200 servers and unlimited bandwidth. So there's no cap. This is going to optimize streaming, whether it's Netflix, ESPN and so on and so forth. So definitely if you're in the market, check the description. I believe for the holiday, they have a deal where it's uh, three free months uh, when you sign up for two years. So uh, check that out. So let's jump right into it. So first thing you want to do is make sure that your IP Vanish app is completely up to date. Normally you can do this from within the settings, but if you're not sure, you can always delete the one that you have and reinstall it from your app store. Just a quick overview of IP Vanish. Like I said, uh, basically what a VPN is going to do is going to encrypt your communication from point A to point B, thus hiding your public IP address and preventing you from being tracked. So uh, for instance, if I wanted to connect to a server that makes it looks like I'm in England, I can go ahead and do that. On this app, I'll just go down to the location. You can see I can pick whatever country I want. All right, so let me go down. I'll go to Birmingham. I'll connect to a Birmingham server. All right. Now, essentially, you can see my public IP address, make it looks like I'm in Birmingham. So in essence, it's going to make it looks like I'm in England and then you can do whatever you need to do as far as access. So that's how that kind of works from a bird's eye view. But uh, this has a lot more features built in. And let me go ahead and dive in and then we're going to get into the new threat protection feature. So on the app, we can set it to connect at startup, as you can see. So once you fire up your Fire TV stick or whatever device you're using, the IP Vanish will automatically connect. It does have VPN protocol, so you can choose uh, between WireGuard, OpenVPN, or IKEV2. You also have LAN access, allows local networks to be routed outside of VPN. Split tunneling is another feature that I really like on a VPN service. And what that does is uh, when you connect your Fi Stick to VPN, it routes all your network traffic through that VPN server. But if you have certain apps or services that you want to still communicate through your local network or through your regular network, you can go ahead and enable that. So let's say I want 3D Mark to not communicate through the VPN. I can select that, or maybe I have a banking app on here that I don't want going through VPN. All I need to do is select that app. And now that app will avoid VPN connections. Like I said, this is good for certain um, applications, maybe certain services. We know that Netflix, for instance, might detect that you're in a VPN will not work. So that may be a use case for that. But I really like split tunneling on a VPN service. You do have app launch. So choose an application to open following a successful connection. So again, this is going to allow you to select any application to automatically launch when you're connected to the VPN. So you also have the VPN status indicator. So this allows the app to display a VPN status notification icon on top of the apps that you're using. So so up to you again if you want to go ahead and turn it on threat protection this is a new feature that i'm talking about so so this is new addition into ip vantage vpn uh, this is going to be compatible with android ios fire tv and it will come to windows and mac in 2024 so key features of this is ad blocking tracker stopping and malicious site prevention so ad blocking this is going to filter content delivered through ad networks and third-party adverts that way it won't appear on your device so the tracker stopping is basically gonna block third-party cookies tracking scripts that's designed to monitor your online activities uh, making it easier to deliver ads to you big fan of that one last one is gonna be malicious site prevention um, phishing sites for instance what that's attempting to to gather or steal your information or websites that harbor and malware prevent them from being able to access your information so pretty cool so I'm gonna go ahead and turn that on and the different devices uh, it might be a little bit different how you turn them on but for the most part you are gonna go into your settings uh, you're gonna 
go to third party protection and then you're going to activate that now available for your your streaming devices it is coming to your pc here in the near future so stay tuned for that again guys just a quick video just going over the new feature of ip vanish definitely if you're in a vpn market check the link in the description let me know what you guys think if you're new to the channel subscribe smash the notification bell thank you for watching and i'll catch you on the next one